Hey, we're Muse, and right after you've seen World War Z tonight, you should come and watch us at the Horse Guards Parade. Straight after the screening, we're playing, uh, we've got our gear set up in Horse Guards Parade, a very um, famous uh, location in London there, and we're playing a free concert for a bunch of our fans. I think we've got about 15,000 fans turning up, hopefully, and it uh, could be crazy, it could be fun. Muse performed at the premiere of World War Z in London and gave equal musical standing to the apocalyptic flick as the film world welcomed Brad Pitt and a post-surgery Angelina Jolie at the premiere. Brad Pitt talked about getting Muse involved. There's a nice gizmet to this story. You know, we got Muse here tonight helping us unleash the film. And from our point of view, when we started making this film a couple of years ago, we were looking for, we discussed trying to find a Tubular Bells, which is, if you remember, that's the theme song to The Exorcist. It wasn't written for The Exorcist. The Exorcist appropriated it, and then it became the theme song for The Exorcist. We wanted to find something that kind of had that same kind of feeling. Lo and behold, these guys, our friends, Muse, were reading the book at the same time that they were writing their album, The, the Second Law. And lo and behold, there is a, there is a, there is a song on there called Second Law that is, uh, is so reminiscent of Tubular Bells. And we found it, we, we lobbied it for it in the film. They at the same time were big fans, and it just worked out beautifully. It's a really nice uh, coming together. Matthew Bellamy and Dominic Howard of Muse talked about the movie. Brilliant, really good. You know, I've got to say, I nearly had a heart attack. You know, there's a couple, there's a couple of moments where there's some like jumpy, jumpy moments, and I've always been one of those people that, like, you know, but it's totally, uh, totally amazing. You know, a real, a real uh, thrill ride. You know, the guys talked about getting involved with World War Z. Yeah, no, we're very honoured to get usage of um, a couple of our songs on the album, uh, Isolated System being the main one. The opening credits when the film opens up, you have all these sort of uh, scenes of chaos from around the world. And, you know, we're really influenced by that kind of apocalyptic stuff. And uh, I actually read World War Z when we were making the album, so it's a perfect fit, really. I'm really happy it's been used. And, uh, and I think, you know, of course it makes the film. What can I say? You know? They chatted about how their music fits in with the film. Uh, yeah, it's great, yeah. I mean, it really, the music really seems to work great with the imagery in the film. And, um, you know, and that song, again, like Matt's saying, it's very, you know, I think when we were creating that song, it came from a very kind of, like, kind of desperate end-of-the-world survival type feeling anyway inside. I think that's what we're trying to like do with the music, so it fits perfectly. The song Second Law is in the film which opens in theaters the weekend of June 21st.